something's fishy. Hey guys, I'm Shark back playing the build that was meta in season five or six. Bruiser Fizz, uh, Bruiser Fizz, yeah, you go like Triforce Blade into tank or Triforce Blade into on hit. So, you know, like usual, if you enjoy, make sure to smash the like, comment, subscribe. Those are the runes we're taking. And, you know, I actually tried this out once before. And just know I was pleased, especially with the mid game side of things. Ooh, Ivern with the cheese. Okay. Yeah, I tried this one game. The one game was supposed to be recorded, but uh, it was too stompy. It was a 15 minute surrender. God, I just stomped lane too hard. That's the problem. But yeah, you max your W. You look to rush Triforce and then afterwards get Blade. And in general, your damage is pretty consistent. You have your W doing basically true damage. And uh, you should, in theory, have a pretty good time. Yeah, that, that's actually good traits. Triforce more for the mid game while, you know, going full tank just early on. It's good for early. You rely on your base damage a lot. We're playing against Nasus, so... You know what he's trying to do. It's just Oh, man, the cannon. He's just trying to AFK farm. It is what it is. The wave will bounce back, and then we could try to freeze it. Or so forth. We took Ignite Flash. The wave is going to bounce back. Yeah, he's got it. He's got all the minions. For a little bit. I mean, he's losing minions, of course, because it's under tower, but... We're trying to pull, yeah, we're trying to pull the wave here. Oh, it's that. We're trying to pull the wave here, freeze it. Let to see, he's level four now? Oh, it feels bad. You know, this is kind of what he wants, but I might be able to cheese an early game kill. No, he heals so much. <sighs> feels bad. Feels bad. I need to hit level four before I look to fight him. Okay. My E won't do anything, but the trade is what it is. Just you wait, Nasus. Actually, believe it or not. Okay, that gives armor shred, right? There we go. Now that was kind of sloppy, but we made it work. And it only gets better for here, uh, from here, at least towards the mid game. And I think Nasus will outskill me, but. Best but okay, that wave is bouncing back. Perfect, perfect. We could get a freeze going on there. He TPs back. That's this it's good stuff, good stuff. <clears throat> okay. So what do I build from Triforce? If you back with 700, I mean you really can get Sheen. Honestly, early game Sheen probably means a lot. Yeah, I'm not kidding. Early game Sheen probably means a lot on Fizz. And uh, I'm pretty sure in season whatever it was, you were actually rushing Sheen because it was a component of Triforce just throughout history of League. Right? Like, you just rush Sheen. Your W. Your W proc is so good. It synergizes really well. Okay, it's going to slow push back to him. Couldn't freeze it. I should have made my item choices a bit quicker. But eh, it is what it is. Zed mid versus Morgana. That's a counter. Can I look there? Or I don't know, Ivern. I don't know if you want a 1v1 Kane, but at the same time, I don't know if you're expecting me to show. Now, if there were a... This is Bruiser slash Tank. If there were a, like, Quinn, Teemo, you'd play safe up until level 6, and you have Sheen, and... Your base damage would actually burst them like an assassin, crazily enough. And I think that's when, yeah, they, oh my, misclicked. They nerfed his base damage, kind of makes sense, a little bit broken, but with the season 11 items, I'm pretty sure we might be able to make something work here. The cane was, 
topside-ish. Place the ward there. And I thought Ivern was going to look for like a scuttle fight with the cane, but I guess not. We're not a burst assassin, so we're not trying to QW him under tower. And then he has a good amount of healing. I'm pretty sure that's his passive. It's fine. The wave bounces back. He loses a good chunk of minions, as you see. The only problem is that he's stacking. But other than that, I mean, this is totally fine. Don't want to pressure anything because he's, he's just going to heal it up with Q. Hmm. Bot lane. Yeah, we could go for like a auto W. Yeah. Auto W to auto for, for press the attack. Ah. Okay. 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 51 CS to 31. Bad. And the wave will slowly bounce back to me. And then we could set up a freeze. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Max E second for wave clear ish and mobile. No, no, not wave clear. Uh, mobility because your E title trickster is what you're known for. And for runes, I took triumph instead of presence of mind because, yeah, there's the cane. That's what I like to see. Spotted him on a ward. Opted for what's it called? Opted for triumph instead of presence of mind because, well. You only need mana if you're always using E, while this build is more for your W and your auto attacks. Um, I'm pretty sure he's just going to R. Yeah. I thought my Ignite would stop him from healing so much, but I guess not. Uh, is this a cannon? The wave is slow pushing back. It's going to be a huge wave when I come back. As long as it doesn't crash and the cannon makes it there on time, we can get boots, vision. Yeah, Nasus. Who let the dogs out? I don't think anyone did because I'm shutting you down early game. BRB. All right, cut, cut, cut. We're back. Oh, man, it did crash. But now we could just slow push it back, so it's okay. I shut down Nasus early game. Gotta know how to freeze. Because all bruisers, all ranged, they beat him. But it's all in the nature of freezing. If you perma shove him and he's just farming under tower, you're giving him opportunity to farm. And that's not good. Yeah, the wave is slow pushing back. That's fine. Honestly, nah, I'm not gonna take blue. Morgana probably needs it more into that style of lane. Um, Ivern, Gank's top. I mean, Nasus has no flash. You have to keep that in mind, so. Far? You don't need a far range shark since. Yeah, no. It's not AP. Look at that. Woo! Big top diff. Thanks a lot, Ivern. That actually did help me a lot. I don't think I could have killed him. And we could stop him from farming stacks as soon as possible. His TB should be up really soon. Like, oh, I don't know. Yeah, now. Because he used it like a minute before I used TP, so that's how I know. What is he going to do? I'm going to go for... Nah, he's just going to heal it up. Holy shit. Do you see that damage? God. Okay, whatever. I did not expect that to be warded. Oh, you're dead. Oh, no, not hiccups. Not like this. Let's get the plated steel cap. Close to building Triforce. You'll love to see it. And we're reinventing the meta in Season 11. I want you guys to comment below. Any build you think is semi-viable. That is good and secret OP. Comment below. And, uh... I probably will do it. Could be for any champ. Could even be for Fizz. Because, well, Season 11 has a lot to unveil. And this is the tip of the iceberg when it comes to creativity. Honestly. Because you could probably come up with 400 combinations. As for builds. On a group of champions. Like Assassins. But... Yeah. 
Back to my freezing shenanigans. <laughs> yeah, Nasus, he's he's uh he's probably fuming. It, it's it's you know it's tough, I'm not gonna lie. When you are playing solo lane top and then the top laner just freezes the lane? I mean it's like what are you supposed to do? You can't even touch the minion without dying. I wouldn't be surprised if he just backed because he has no clue what to really do. Or he's farming his jungler's camps. Yeah, he did back. Now it's really big, consistent damage. Triforce, of course, being power spike for mid-game-ish. I might just crash him back. Crash him back. Crash him back. Not a cannon wave, but eventually, yeah. It's just the best move. Because look, we can get Triforce now. Big, huge buy. And as for their comp, if I get plated steel cap and then RG Guardian's Angel last item ish, I should be fine. Oh, Draven. Draven got the snipe off. He got the Morgana just like that. But you know what? It's okay. I'll carry. Let's just. Oh, I see, I see. Because they changed Triforce. What was it? I forgot. Movement speed for three seconds. If it targets. What does it do? I don't know, but it's new and improved and it's better. So, get Triforce. <laughs> Smile. Okay. Uh, Zed is roaming bots. I don't think he could do much. There's no way. Ivern's there. And then Ivern's like, uh... Semi-counter? Yeah, semi-counter to... Assassins. At least when it comes for peeling for someone. Comes to. Level 11 Zed. Look at that. See? Triforce Power Spike. QW Auto Auto. Why is Kane top? I should live this. He still has W, I think? No, he already used it. Oh. Big mistake. Oh, big mistake on my part. Hmm. Because I should have just stood under tower, but of course his uh, R range is farther. Further. When he's... Yeah. Blue form. I'm very sure of that. Well, we have TP. Now that I've played Steel Cap, it's going to be a lot more manageable. Blue cane assassins. Yuck. Depends what you play. Honestly, with this build, assassins are going to be manageable. But. Oh, he's top again. Does he love me that much? Does he know who I am? There's Eclipse. He has no R. That's just kind of annoying. Ivern, show top, please. Show top. Just show your top. Look for a counter gank or something. Actually. I think he's at uh, Scuttle Crab. I'm literally just getting so tilted. Non-stop top. Non-stop top. And I'm not even like a squishy. It wouldn't even be ideal for him to camp me. Actually, just... What the fuck? Look for the cane. Okay. He ulties, but I mean, nah, we're good. He needs to camp bot. Oh, Zed. Literally, uh, I mean, I could get it. Yeah, Morgana's getting it. If <laughs> if Kane wants to find success, Kane needs to camp bot. I don't know why. He's always top. It's top lane. I just it's a rule. It's a mystery. It's either you get camped or you get no attention. 
I call that the lost rule, the forgotten rule, the 1v1 island. Actually. B <laughs> well, I mean, it has a whole combination of getting stomped, being the one stomping, and just a boring lane where you're farming for 20 minutes until you guys are team fighting. It's, it's, it's one of those. And you know what? This game, I guess we're the one dominating, even though we're getting camped. So, yeah. I think uh, Nasus is recalling. I wonder if he's going to get MR. Or he's looking to... Oh, he's not recalling. MR or armor. Because I deal a good amount of mix, actually. With my W, too. Oh, the Zed. He fails. But the blue cane, on the other hand, nah, he fails. Yeah. You gain movement speed when you auto the new Triforce. Look at that. Movement speed for two seconds. You love to see it. Earth destroyed mid. Nasus. Hey, top lane is so much more different. Different, er. So much more different than mid. It's like you could just zone them for the next 20 minutes or so but mid lane you're gonna be at these fights if they don't want to play aggressive you could force aggressive plays bot lane in the jungle and so forth but top lane is the number one lane if you want like resident sleeper just you know what i mean only top lane mains will understand actually Oh, I thought he was going to W me. Interesting. Uh, he probably still has flash. Yeah. Waiting for that to expire. We have vamp steps, so we're healing every auto. Wouldn't be surprised if Kane shows top. Wouldn't be surprised. I don't care. Ah. Uh. Now oh, we're doing fine. I want to be looking for picks. Just first tower? No! <laughs> I'm tilted. I'm tilted. I thought it dealt like like one tick of damage, two tick of damage, three tick of damage if you just shark them. But I guess it's only when it goes off. You learn something new every day. Whatever. It's all good. I'm not gonna lie. Nasus has the possibility, yeah, to beat us. Possibility. He has like 200 stacks, I'm guessing. Oh, Nasus is there, but I'm here. So I think we could turn this. Depends how we play this fight out. Yeah. All right, we shoot the R. Rampage. I'm not dying. I'm not dying. <laughs> I mean, legit, this bruisery style build, I mean. <laughs> you, lo you love to see it again. Bruiser Fizz. I'm telling you guys, the new meta. This mid game is killer. Now, third item. I mean, what should we want to buy? Uh, uh bruiser fighter that's actually a good question you know what we're gonna build titanic yeah oh we're gonna build titanic and then tp top oh or pickaxe and then tp top legit this is amazing the only thing that could shut us down is nasus if he scales. But, I mean, uh, we, we restricted the amount of stacks he could get by, like, a lot. Like, look, look at him. Oh, yeah. It's over. Blade of the Rune King just shreds tanks now. It's over. And I have lifesteal on my auto attacks. Oh! Actually, Gauchi Hyper. 
Fizz Bruiser mid game. Do you not see this? Oh, oh. It's over. I'm pretty sure you even know this. My god. <laughs> My god. Actually. Lulu? Ah, uh, Lulu has shield and W. I can't stand it, so. I've red buff, so. I'm looking to play aggressive. There's no way he goes for this. Um. Okay. That was supposed to be a double, but. I mean. Oh, uh, okay. Um. That's actually huge for Kane, believe it or not. That shutdown right there, that's like a thousand gold I think I gave him. I gave him like 850 because my shutdown bounty was 500. Yeah, I'm not kidding. That is like huge for Kane. But the thing is, is that like in the side lane situation, like you see what, what is happening. I mean, I'm, I'm up 100 CS, three levels. I shred tanks, Blade of the Rune King, key. Absolutely key. I'm pretty sure they nerfed the percentage HP it takes away from your opponent right something it was like 16 percent for melee targets last season this season it's 10 percent and it is a ad on hit but no it's 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 still pretty good as you see we could take drag i'm just gonna split push top i have wave clear from team mat now and yeah blue does help but red probably helps a little bit more yikes that is uh, a lot of damage from the Zed. But after I get my third item, I'll get GA. That'll give me some armor tankiness along with extra AD, some survivability, and it's it's over. Um, yeah, we get drag. I, I knew it. Come on, team. I had faith. I have faith in your team sometimes. I don't want to show there because look. Now we're split pushing top. Tired of these hiccups, man. Mm. Oh. Holy shit. So tilting. Oh. But I think we're fine now. Let's shred the tower. And onwards and out. The adventure continues. We have enough for Titanic Hydra. It's like, should we back for that? Well, okay, there's like a lot of people who can get me. It's probably best we recall here. Yeah. Get this and then build Blade of the Rune King. Uh, not Blade of the Rune King. Guardian's Angel, last item. Honestly, we could team fight though. That's the thing. We could split push or team fight. I want to 1v1 someone though. Uh, it's no longer an active, but just a passive. Okay. That's not bad. Oh, Morgana. Oh, Draven. Kane, you're, you're, you're so dead. You're so dead. Come on. Yeah, you, you guys are done for. I, I, I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm laughing at the fact that you guys are focusing me. Holy. Mother Lord. Jesus Christ. It's on hit. Oh my. What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm literally just mowing them down. GG wall played like usual, guys. If you enjoyed, please smash the like. Comment any build suggestions you have. Subscribe. Turn on that post notification bell. Check out all my social medias in the description below. I will catch you next time. I'm out. Come on.